how to use dictation on Mac if you're using MacBook Air or MacBook Pro, the steps are going to be same. Now, if you don't know what dictation is, then let me tell you in short that if you want to do voice typing uh, instead of typing manually on your keyboard, then you can use dictation feature. Now to enable it, first of all, you need to go in system settings, which you can find in dock or else go and select Apple logo and then select system settings. Now, once you open settings page on the left hand side, go down and look for keyboard option, select that. And on the right hand side, you get multiple options. Now, just go down and look for dictation. Once you find it, uh, there will be a toggle over here. So in order to enable dictation, make sure you turn on this toggle and select enable option over here. Once you do that, then later on, you can choose the language which you want. So currently I have selected English, uh, United States and India for now. You can choose any language which you want. After selecting the language, you can choose the microphone source um, or if you have connected an external mic, you can select that option over here. Also, you can use shortcut button to start using dictation. So you can just select this drop down and either you can use the mic button or else you can use control key or globe key or command key, whichever is fine with you. You can just select that particular option. And once you do that, the next option you get is auto punctuation. Now how this works when it is turned on that I'll, uh, you know, I'll explain you later. Now everything is done. Dictation is enabled. Now let's start using it. So to use dictation, I'm going to open a page over here or I'm going to open a new document in pages application. Now you can see I can start writing manually over here. So in order to use voice to type or voice to text feature or let's say dictation feature, all you have to do is just press the shortcut which you have selected. In my case, I have selected mic uh, shortcut. So whenever I'm going to press that key on my keyboard, you will get a mic icon over here. And later on, whatever I speak, it will be written over here. So I'm going to press F5, which has mic key. iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 plus feature the 48 megapixel fusion camera system with powerful upgrades and the action button to quickly access useful features. Now you can see whatever I was speaking, uh, it has converted to text. Now, instead of axis over here, I spelled access. So yeah, there might be a few miss here and there, but almost you can see each and everything is almost fine. Now, if you want to give any particular punctuation, you have to spell it. So you have to say it, then only it will add the punctuation over there. Now I will show you the auto punctuation feature. So again, let's go in system settings and let's turn on auto punctuation. What it will do is we don't have to spell any punctuation over there. Automatically it will detect it and it will add it if it feels. So we are going to repeat the same text over here and let's see uh, if it is working or not. Again, press the mic key. iPhone 16 and 16 plus features the new 48 megapixel fusion camera system with powerful upgrades and the action button to quickly access useful features. While iPhone 16 Pro and 16 Pro Max introduce larger display sizes, powerful Pro camera capabilities and a huge leap in battery life. Let's stop it. Now you can see I haven't said any comma or anything, but it has detected the pause and it, uh, it has uh, basically added the punctuation over there. So you can again check it out if it is working or not properly. So this is how simple it is to use dictation feature in your Mac. So instead of typing, you can just speak and it will be converted to text. So guys, if you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.